Hi, this is Dan York, and I'm the host of Emerging Tech Talk, and we're here today with Chris Matthew, who is uh, the creator of a company called Teleku, and today we're announcing that Voxeo has acquired Teleku, and Chris is joining our Voxeo Labs team to work on Tropo and much more. So welcome to Voxeo, Chris. Thank you, Dan. I'm very excited to be part of the Voxeo team now. So uh, what, uh, what brought about the creation of Teleku? What's your background, or how did you get into all this? Well, I saw an opportunity, and um, I, my background is enterprise. So for the past uh, 20 years, I've been working in the enterprise space and watching the challenges that those large companies have, um, with Voice XML in particular. So uh, here's how it works. A, a big company, they get involved in a, in a voice portal project. They have to take their most talented web person uh, off the web team send them to voice XML programming school <laughs> and, and learning platforms and all this heavy telco stuff and I just finally realized that wow that, that's a significant investment and if I could just utilize my entire team of web developers uh, to build telephony applications along with web applications we'd be much further along in the enterprise so an idea and an opportunity was born and and Teleku to some degree uh, was a comp Heating product to the Tropo solution, so um, it, it's I, I think it's exciting the the ideas that I can bring to the uh, Voxeo Labs team of uh, you know maybe how a different approach maybe we, we can kind of take the best of both uh, strategies and, and combine them into something even bigger than what we've both been trying to accomplish separately. That's cool. Now maybe for folks who aren't familiar with Teleku, can you talk a little bit about uh, what it does, what it what you can do there? Absolutely. Uh, Teleku is a RESTful uh, web service um, that allows any web programmer with any type of web language uh, from uh, Java to .NET, Ruby on Rails, etc., PHP, Python, etc., um, build very sophisticated uh, telephony applications, both SMS and voice, uh, with speech recognition. And we've been, uh, interestingly yeah. enough, a Voxeo uh, customer. Right, it's running on Voxeo ultimately. Yeah, yeah. And, and to even make it more interesting, um, I view Teleku's secret sauce as at the end of the day, while it's really easy as an API to allow web developers to build um, phone applications, at the end of the day, we turn it into old traditional voice XML technology. <laughs> so we can attach, we could have attached to any carrier uh, as our platform, but we chose Voxeo from day one because of. Uh, the sophistication of your network, the scalability that you guys offer, the, the types of speech recognition and text-to-speech engines that you have, um, your SLAs, 100% you know, of the time, <laughs> where does that exist in today's market? So we, from the beginning, we decided to attach our, our train to the, the biggest train in the industry, and um, I'm, I'm really excited and pleased how things uh, worked out this way. That's great. Now, you're going to be working with the labs team, obviously, focusing a lot around Tropo. I know you've done some work with Tropo. What, what excited you most about starting to work with Tropo? Well, you know, um, I, I could, you know I'm a one-man shop with Teleku, so I'm glad to, first of all, have a, a team of extremely talented, smarter-than-me uh, developers and engineers, which is really uh, what I was missing, you know, that opportunity where you can bounce ideas off with others and, and end up with an, an idea that, that's bigger than yours at the end of the day. So I'm really excited about that. Also, the, uh, the worldwide infrastructure that you guys have, I was always tr relying on, on Voxeo to do certain things for me. And, um, you know, certain things like SMS, you know, you're, you're at the, the core of the SMS network um, and, and opportunities where I thought that Teleku needed to go now I can fall back and rely more strategically on uh, Voxeo and Tropo's initiatives. Um, it, I, I really see even bigger things that are going to happen in the near future with, with these technologies. That's cool. Now I know it's a little too early to figure out how, the, how Teleku fits into everything, but uh, uh, I know you'll be working on that in your time here with the company. So, well, welcome aboard, and, and if people want to learn more about Teleku, where can they go? It's teleku.com, T-E-L-E-K-U, kind of a Japanese-sounding uh, theme you know, around Ruby on Rails. Ruby's a Japanese right. uh, language, so we've got our, our mascot as a, a sumo wrestler, which was trying to show you know, 
large 800 pound, 1,000 pound gorilla, you know, in this space. Two products, right? We have Samurai Warrior that runs on uh, on uh, all of Voxeo's uh, voice XML infrastructure, yeah. and then we have Ninja, which is more of a, a skinny, agile, uh, free uh, platform that runs an EC2, Amazon EC2. Yeah, oh, that's cool. Um, so, so it doesn't have near the, the functionality or, or elegant sounding text-to-speech. It's all an open source stack. Yeah. Uh, so I'm really excited to maybe help uh, uh, Trapo with some of the lessons le I, le I had, you know, dealing with the EC2 and some of those other uh, instances as well. That's cool. All in the cloud. Well, well, thanks for your time. I've been speaking with Chris Matthew, who is the founder of Teleku, and is now joining the Voxeo Labs team to uh, work with us in the. Well, are you going to be in San Francisco? No, you're I'll in. I'll be in Phoenix. In Phoenix. Working very closely with San yeah. Fran and Orlando and. I'm happy to be, what's that, a Voxeon? Is a Voxeon, yes, you are now. <laughs> <laughs> I have to load me up a t-shirt so I can take back and give away. That's awesome. <laughs> All right, well, welcome aboard, Chris. Thank you, Dan. Pleasure. You've been watching an episode of Emerging Tech Talk. If you've got comments on this episode, please go to blogs.voxeo.com slash ETT or send me email to dyork at voxeo.com. Thanks for your time.